open education resources, al-mawarid ta'limiyya al-maftuha, are teaching and learning materials that you may freely and openly use and reuse without charge. The Faculty of Humanities embraced the university initiative in 2014 to bring OER on campus in order to use it for innovation and research. Open educational resources can be found on online repositories and these range from full OER courses such as the MIT courseware and the Sailor Foundation uh, to OER Commons as well as the OpenStax library which not only make the OER resources or the materials available but also perceptions and experiences uh, posted by um, educators who have used these materials before. The great thing about using OER in the classroom over the years, I've noticed that students have not only generated their own content along with the content that I have included, but they've been able to download things from the internet and they interact with students in other parts of the world. Using OER was very enjoyable. It was the first time I uh, hear of OER. We used it in this course analysis at NDU. It is uh, more updated than a book. We could easily share uh, photos, uh, videos, and articles uh, and use the media to our benefit without paying the price of a book. The advantages of open educational resources clearly outweigh the disadvantages. Whereas there's a lot of discussion about reducing student costs by providing access to digital material that is openly licensed and avoiding the high costs of printed traditional textbooks, Students also encounter access to high quality material that is openly licensed and thus avoid copyright infringement. In addition, students are able to benefit from the latest knowledge in their field. It is a much more dynamic environment and overall it's much more fun to learn with OER. Using OER material in the sophomore rhetoric and discourse analysis courses has proven to have several advantages for both instructors and students. For instance, in the sophomore rhetoric course, uh, choosing material that is up to date, uh, material that has been used by other instructors in, um, in universities abroad that can be modified according to my students' needs has proven to be more, um, more um, interesting to the students and made them more interactive in class. OER was very helpful and uh, very interactive. We used it in sophomore rhetoric. Uh, we could uh, easily find topics to debate on. We could easily uh, find articles, find videos, uh, and uh, it was a good experience not using a book because you can always forget your book, but you can never forget your cell phone, you can never forget your laptop. You can easily just access them and uh, find whatever you want online. The libraries are providing support for the OER initiatives at NDU by including OER resources in our multi-search. So when users search for library resources, they also find OER resources by educating users about Creative Commons. Creative Commons is a nonprofit organization that provides free tools that let authors, scientists, artists, and educators easily mark their creative work with the freedom they want it to carry. You can use CC to change your copyright terms from all right reserved to some right reserved. Creative Commons have six different type of licenses. If you'd like to know more about CC licenses, please visit www.creativecommons.org.